Hello, I'm Simpsy Zephyr 9 and welcome back to another LEGO Star Wars custom character a showcase video. Today, this is video is going live on uh, May 4th, so um, may the 4th be with you. But today's video, we're going to do a not a casual one or two showcasing custom characters. I'm showing six different characters, all from Rogue One. So, um, this start kick right into this with our first two characters, shall we? So to start off our showcase, we have Jin Erso and Cassian Andor. First of all, uh, here is Jin Erso. She has a single blaster and a grappling hook. Based off how she is, like, pretty much all the way through the movie. <laughs> On the screen now, you'll see um, the code, and if you want to add it to your own to your own game. Don't know if it's still bugged or not, but in the link in the description below, there will be all the codes for all the characters we show up today. This, this, this is Jin, which is pretty great. Um, I couldn't find a uh, really good hairpiece for her, so she's using the um, Padme Amidala hairpiece with a with one of the Jakku like thugs torsos, which kind of gives off like the like the jacket she wears. And then she's got her um, Han Solo gun deco um, pants pieces. Next we have Cassian, the code will be on the screen now. Cassian pretty much uses a lot of hand solo. <laughs> and this is based off his Edu look and Jedi look. Um, I decided to give him a sniper for when like from the scene where he's on Edu. And he's going to uh, trying to assassinate Galen Urso. That's a little spoiler, but how can you call yourself a Star Wars fan if you've not seen Rogue One already? So back to the um, character showcase. So this is just another look at Cassian. Again, codes in the description if you want to add it into your own game. So this has been Jin and Cassian in Lego Star Wars The Force Awakens video game. Let's move on to our next two characters. One with the force and the force is with me. So our next two characters from Rogue One we have Chirrut and Baze. So we have, we have, this is Baze. This is um, the code on the screen now with like the uh, official Lego minifigure up there. With Baze uh, they do have the official hairpiece that the official minifigure uses but I decided that this hairpiece kind of works better for him. Um, so we have him with his big machine gun, which isn't actually this big, but this was like the best they really had. Uh, it, it works. I mean. Because like there's no way of actually getting the big like um sort of like backpack he has like the cooler for his gun. But I think this actually does work pretty well for base. So next up we have uh Cherit, who is somewhat accurate to be fair. Um I give him a weapon, or just a staff. 
I was tempted to maybe give him uh, the bow caster because he does have that um that giant bow in the film, but I think the staff is a uh, more iconic for the character. Um, he's like the only character who I've actually used the official hairpiece on. That is the actual hairpiece that the actual minifigure uses. It works well, so I decided to keep it. So there we have Chera and Baze, um, Guardians of the Wills. Now on to our final two characters. So for our final two characters we have Bodhi Rook and Saw Gorella. First of all Brody, um It was sort of a difficult one because Um I tried to follow what the official lip Lego minifigure had and this was like the closest I could come up with it. I, I think it works okay. Um, I decided against giving him a weapon. Yeah, I decided not to give him a weapon because he doesn't really have... He doesn't actually use any weapons in the movie. So, uh... Whereas, like, the official, like, all the figures and all the, um... And the Lego minifigure all come with like blasters and stuff, but in the movie he didn't use it, so I decided not to give him one. And then last of all, we have Saw Gorilla. Saw so decided to give him his staff, like a, a stick staff, like he uses to walk around. Um, I think. The detail on um, Saw is pretty great. I was gonna give him the grey um, piece, but mm, it looked a little out, so I decided just to give him the black, like the thin black hair. Uh, Saw Grella isn't hasn't got a, an official Lego minifigure, so. This was basically 100% custom based off no, based off just what we see in the movie alone. If you want to add him into your game, the code will be on the screen here. And yeah. So this has been my uh, LEGO Star Wars The Force Awakens video game Rogue One uh, character showcase. Um, hope you've enjoyed and you've liked, liked these characters. Again, all the codes will be in the description if you want to put them into your game. Um, out of all of them, I kind of like Saw Gorilla. He's my fa <laughs> I think he's my favourite of all my customers. Yeah. But this has been the video, guys. Um, if you've enjoyed, leave the video a thumbs up. Share the codes with your friends so they can add um, these characters to the game if they want. I've been Simply Zacco9, hope you've enjoyed, and may the force be with you. Bye bye. <laughs>